Lions fans, thank you for watching Inside the Pride. I'm Dylan. I'm Jalen. And next week on October 10th, we play Bethel at home. Girls play at 5. And the guys play at 7. We hope to see you there because when we go to Bethel, they always have a big student section, so let's do the same at Freed. We hope to see you there. Go Lions! All right, welcome to this week's edition of Inside the Pride, where we're starting off this week with the men's basketball team mic'd up. Hey, get into that ball. Get down. Get your hand on the ball. Get better. Good. Set the tone. Good, Sam. Good, Sam. Hey, red down there. Gray right down here. You drill. Start in five seconds. Get him a ball. Get him a ball. Five. Let's go. Half of you down there. Half of you in that corner. Half of you in this corner. Let's go. It's not hard to figure out. Good, Mo. Good, Mo. Good, good. Good, Keita. Good, Keita. Come here, come here. 21. Knock it down, Sam. Good shot. Oh, you. Oh, finish that. In the gap, Mo. Right there, Mo. In the gap, JJ. Under the basket. Circle. Who's got ball? Be in the gap. Good job, It's a big boy. It's a big, that's a big boy. Be perfect right here, Gray. Be perfect. Be physical. Yeah, he just said. Try and get in. Uh, all you're trying to do is get paint touch. Just not shooting a layup. You're just trying to get paint touch. Let's go, Gray. Let's go. Come on, Gray. There you go. Go, Phil. There we go. All right, ball. Yeah, Chris. Yeah, Chris. Talk. Yeah. Yeah. Out there. Good, Jaden. Yeah. Yeah. What's going on Lions fans? I'm Michael Mullenix. And I'm Rachel Satterley. And welcome to this week's edition of Inside the Pride. We've got a lot of action to catch you up on, so let's get right to it. Last Tuesday, both the men's and women's soccer team hosted the Blue Raiders and Lindsey Wilson. In the women's action, Lindsey Wilson got two goals early, but Brooke Latham would be able to hold it off until late in the second half when Lindsey Wilson would put this away to win the conference matchup 3 to nothing. And then in men's action, we saw a highly defensive contested match led by the Lions and Dylan Vaughn with some smooth slide tackles to keep the Lions in the game. But unfortunately, the fourth-ranked Blue Raiders come away with this one three to nothing. Lady Lions in action against Campbellsville here. Campbellsville on the serve. This one's gonna be set up by Adams off the dig and Avery Harris with the kill. Puts the Lady Lions down by eight. Campbellsville off the serve here. And they're gonna get this one over. Nice dig here by the Lady Lions. And Morgan Wilson with the set. Audrey Orton with the kill. Lady Lions cut the lead in half here. All tied up here, Lindsey Wilson on the serve. And this is going to be a nice dig here by Rivera and Morgan Wilson with the back set. And RJ Orton with a kill. Lady Lions go up one here. Lindsey Wilson just takes the lead. They're going on the serve here. Puts it over to Young. Young gets it set by Adams. Harris has this block back, but she's able to get the dig. And Rivera off the set by Adams. Hits it over to the left side and down on the floor. Lady Lions tie this one up. Lady Lions, a hard fought weekend, but unfortunately will drop both in straight sets to two very talented teams in the Mid-South Conference Volleyball standings. Men's and women's tennis came home from Maryville College in Murfreesboro, Tennessee with wins. The men won their matches 9-0 and the women won 8-1. Cross country teams went to Louisville this weekend for the Live in the Lou Cross Country Classic. Daniel Puckett and Maddie Grant both were in the top 25 for their events, each event with over 400 runners from 50 different NCAA and NAIA schools. Let's send it over to Vincent Menino for this week's Play of the Week. Welcome to this week's Play of the Week. We're going to do something a little different this week. We have four amazing plays from the first five weeks of the season to show you, and we want you, the audience, to vote on them in the comments section below. There'll be a number and a title with each replay that you see, and if you'll pick your favorite and post that in the comments below, uh, then whoever has the most votes will play that play again next week. Thanks so much for watching Inside the Pride. We hope you enjoy this play of the week. Number one, Volleyball Hustle.
Number two, women's soccer free kick. Number three, Mahala's goal laying down. Number four, Fleener's laser. Lions and Lady Lions with a lot of upcoming events here starting with men's and women's soccer this afternoon in Williamsburg, Kentucky against the University of the Cumberlands. Both teams are looking for their first conference win against both ranked Patriots teams. Men's and women's tennis are on the road tomorrow, Friday and Saturday in Bowling Green for the fall Mid-South Conference Tournament. Good luck to our Lions and Lady Lions in their matches. Volleyball will also be on the road this week at Georgetown on Thursday as both teams look for their first conference win of the season. And then on Friday, the Lady Lions volleyball team will be taking on another Mid-South Conference contender, the University of the Cumberlands. The Lady Lions will be looking to get a big win and hopefully gain momentum here in their midseason. Cross Country team will be gone on Saturday for the University of the Ozarks Invitational in Clarksville, Arkansas. This will be the team's first matchup in Arkansas this year. And rounding out the week will be a big men's and women's soccer game against in-state conference rival Bethel on Tuesday here in Henderson. Go Lions! All right, that's going to do it for this week's episode of Inside the Pride. So until next time, I'm Michael Molinix. And I'm Rachel Satterley. And we thank you for watching this week's episode, and we will see you next time here on Inside the Pride. We want to thank you for watching Inside the Pride. Uh, thank you so much for uh, tuning in. Make sure that you like and subscribe on all of our social media platforms. Uh, if you're interested in joining uh, Linebackers or Director Circle, make sure that you uh, uh, look, look us up on the website or... Uh, contact us on the info below. We're so glad that you tuned in today. Go Lions!